Thank you to the Academy for this honor of honors. They told me I only have 45 seconds up here, which is 45 seconds more than the Senate gave John Bolton this week. William Bradley Pitt, or simply known as Brad Pitt, is an American actor and film producer. He was born on December 18, 1963 in Shawnee, Oklahoma. To William Alvin Pitt, the proprietor of a trucking company, and Jane Etta Nee Hillhouse, a school counselor. His family soon moved to Springfield, Missouri, where he lived together with his younger siblings, Douglas Mitchell, born in 1966, and Julie Neal, born in 1969. Born into a conservative Christian household, he was raised as a Southern Baptist and later oscillated between agnosticism and atheism. Pitt attended Kikapu High School where he was a member of the golf, swimming, and tennis teams. He then enrolled in the University of Missouri in 1982, majoring in journalism with a focus on advertising. As graduation approached, Pitt did not feel the need to settle down. He loved films, and since films were not made in Missouri, he left the university and moved to Los Angeles where he took acting lessons from coach Roy London. Pitt's career began in 1987, with uncredited parts in various films. He then had multiple appearances in different films until he was signed as the main actor in the film The Dark Side of the Sun. In 1999, Pitt portrayed Tyler Durden in Fight Club. He then prepared for the part with lessons in boxing, taekwondo, and grappling. To lick the part, Pitt consented to the removal of pieces of his front teeth which were restored when filming ended. Other than Fight Club, he appeared in the heist film Ocean's Eleven, Snatch, and many more. During the years of 2004 to 2008, he was recognized worldwide as he starred in different major films such as Troya's Achilles, Ocean's Twelve as Rusty Ryan, Mr. and Mrs. Smith as John Smith, World War Z, and many more. He established himself as one of the most successful and sought-after actors in Hollywood and was able to garner numerous awards. He has also been cited as a sex symbol by many sources. They named him one of the 25 sexiest stars in film, People's Sexiest Man Alive, and he was included in the 100 Most Powerful Celebrities from 2006 to 2008 to name a few. Aside from his career in Hollywood, he joined humanitarian and political causes. Pitt visited the University of Missouri campus in October 2004, and this was to encourage students to vote in the 2004 U.S. presidential elections in which he supported John Kerry. Later in October, he publicly supported the principle of public funding for embryonic stem cell research. Another thing he supports is One Campaign, an organization aimed at combating AIDS and poverty in the developing world. Pitt founded the Make It Right Foundation, which organizes housing professionals to finance and construct 150 affordable and sustainable new houses in New Orleans 9th Ward following the devastation caused by Hurricane Katrina. From the late 1980s to the early 1990s, Pitt was romantically involved with several of his co-stars. One of them was Jennifer Aniston, who he got engaged to in 1998 and married on July 29, 2000 in a small wedding in Malibu, California. However, in January 2005, they were compelled to announce their divorce. Consequently, Pitt's relationship with Mr. and Mrs. Smith co-star Angelina Jolie was made public during his divorce proceedings. There was no infidelity according to Jolie and Pitt who said they fell in love on the spot. As they appeared together more frequently in 2005, they were referred to as Brangelina by the entertainment industry. And it was only on January 11, 2006 that Jolie confirmed to people that she was pregnant with Pitt's child. August 23, 2014 was the date of their intimate wedding at Chateau Miraval in France. Together, Pitt and Jolie established a charitable organization named the Jolie Pitt Foundation, which aims to aid humanitarian causes around the world. The foundation made the following. 
A donation of $100,000 in memory of the late American journalist Daniel Pearl donated $1 million for emergency medical assistance to help victims of the Haiti earthquake and lastly donated $1 million each to Global Action for Children and Doctors Without Borders. According to federal filings, Pitt and Jolie invested $8.5 million into the foundation in 2006. However, on September 19, 2016, Jolie filed for divorce from Pitt, citing irreconcilable differences. And they were declared officially divorced on April 12, 2019. Despite the fact that Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt's marriage did not work out, their children from their time together are unquestionably positioned for success. Maddox at 20, Pax at 18, Zahara 17, Shilo 16, and the 13 year old twins Knox and Vivian are among the couple's six children. Two of Angelina Jolie's children, Maddox and Zahara, were adopted by the actress before she started dating Pitt. They then adopted Pax, and on that same year, Angelina Jolie gave birth to Shilo. The following year, the couple announced that they were expecting twins together, namely Knox and Vivian. Brad Pitt's net worth is estimated to be $300 million. And with a fortune of $300 million, Brad Pitt is considerably one of Hollywood's most successful and sought-after actors. Brad earned his first big payday in the movie, Thelma and Louise, netting him $6,000 for the role in 1991. His earnings then exploded with his role in California two years later, netting him $500,000. Pitt's breakthrough role occurred with the film Seven in 1995, earning him $5 million for the part. The following year, Brad would double his earnings with a $10 million payday for Sleepers. He kept this pay ceiling with his role in 7 years in Tibet the following year. He then went on to earn $10 million each for his role in Inglorious Bastards and Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. To date, Brad Pitt has been paid a total of $17.5 million for his work on 4 films. Meet Joe Black, Spy Game, Fight Club, and Troy. He then earned $20 million for his role in Mr. and Mrs. Smith. But when Quentin Tarantino offered him the chance to work with him, he decided to cut his remuneration by a quarter. For his role in Ocean's Eleven, at the end of the film's theatrical run, Brad took home $30 million in revenue. George Clooney, Julia Roberts, Don Chittle, Bernie Mac, and Al Pacino all starred in the three Ocean's films that Pitt was a part of. More money came from Brad's producing roles in upcoming films than his starring career as an actor. A significant portion of Brad Pitt's wealth is invested in real estate in the United States and all over the world. His primary residence is in Los Feliz, Los Angeles, but it is said to believe that he owns properties in Hollywood Hills, New Orleans, Missouri, and France. He also has a beach house in Santa Barbara for $4 million. A mansion in the French Quarter for $3.5 million A villa on the Spanish island of Mallorca for $3.7 million And for $67 million, he and Angelina Jolie bought a vineyard spanning 1,200 acres in the south of France As for his personal vehicles, he owns a Chevy Tahoe An Aston Martin Vanquish Carbon Edition An Audi Q7 A BMW Hydrogen 7 A Chevy Camaro Double S A Lexus LS460 F Sport A Tesla Model S A Husqvarna Nude 900R An MV Augusta Brutal An Indian Larry Bike Crook WCC 140 CFL A Shinya Kimura Custom And finally, an XA Titanium Series XX 
Angelina Jolie had previously given him a $1.6 million chopper as a present. He also has a World War II Spitfire that is estimated to be worth $3.3 million. Brad Pitt also has a watch collection and this includes a Rolex GMT Master, a Rolex Daytona, a Rolex Day-Day 2, a Rolex Yacht Master, a Blanc Pond 50 Fathoms, a tank of Gachet, a paddock Felipe Nautilus, and a paddock 5205. Future billionaires, take Brad's lead and go for your dreams. According to him, the best ideas come from those who have faith in them and are willing to put their whole selves into making them come to Frisian. Everything is indeed possible when you put your vision to life and use each struggle as a stepping stone to even move forward. You can always seize the moment and utilize each second for your manifested growth. Just keep on believing, future billionaires! Keep tuning in to our channel, Luxury Max, to find out more about the latest reward trends of the super rich, where we will be creating quality content videos for you to enjoy. Make sure to hit the like and subscribe button and feel free to comment down on what we should make a video about next. Thank you for listening and we'll see you guys in the next video.